We can do mechanical experiments to predict the bite force of T-Rex. It's amazingly high, higher than any living animal, on the order of around seven, 8,000 pounds. A bite force this large doesn't really cut through things. It causes bones to explode. To calculate bite force, it's a combination of using mathematical and mechanical models. The best living analog for looking at bite force in, the, in animals like Tyrannosaurus rex is to study other big carnivorous reptiles, I mean, notably crocodilians. What is your advice to kids who want to be scientists? For kids who are interested in science, I would say keep asking questions. Listen to your questions. Don't wave them away. And make sure that you uh, explore them with the adults in your life. What? How did you figure out what you wanted to be when you grew up? When I was growing up, I spent a lot of time outside. Uh, climbing trees, running into big snakes at times. I grew up in Brazil, so in a very rural area. Uh, in addition, my father is a scientist and my mom is an architect and an amateur paleontologist, so we did a lot of exploring and a lot of scientific uh, questions came up in my house.